Ladies and gentlemen, the following contest is scheduled for one round in a seven minute time limit in the brown belt division at 175 pounds. Introducing your first competitor, fighting right. out of the blue corner. Representing Team Took in fighting out of Houston, Texas. Here we go. This is Eric right. Garcia. El Jefe, Mr. Garcia promotions himself up here. And introducing his opponent across the stage, fighting out of the red corner. Representing Strike and Submit in Henzo Gracie, this is Luis Mencia. Seven minute time limit, match number 16. Let's see, I try to go for a single leg dig down. Hey. Stuff. It's coming out very aggressive. You know, he's, he's, he's much younger here than Eric. Eric is an old, 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 <laughs> old man. AARP is calling. AARP is calling. But uh, you see Garcia already working that grip on, on the top of the collar there, looking to set up that baseball bat choke. One of, you know, the go to El Jefe submission. You think Mancia is a kind of tunnel vision and trying to get that being aggressive and not realizing that? No, nah, I mean, he's, uh, you know, he's addressing kind of similar. He's, yeah, it's hard to tell. He's definitely wanting to come out and be the bully here. So it's hard to tell if he recognizes what's going on back there. But at, at the brown belt level, yeah, I'm, I'm pretty sure you have. You know, generally at the brown belt level, you're just a black belt waiting for your time. I'm a brown belt sitting here watching everybody compete. There you go. <laughs> there you go. Brown belt of life. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Looks like there might have been a, a headbutt there. Eric's got some, uh, looks like a little red spot on his head. There, there he goes, setting up that baseball bat choke again. And then he's going to jump guard, which is one way to stop Eric from turning. Eric has got a big old bump on his head there. Bringing him to his corner. Bringing him to his corner so he can listen to his coach. <laughs> Luis Mencia is having none of that. He's walking right there. There's that baseball bat choke for Mr. Garcia. Good defense. Oh, no, he's still going to turn. Eric with the takedown. Great job. Now, already, Luis Mencia is looking in for that collar high grip. Coming he's going to try and push minutes. that arm down. Halfway through here. I see it working from up top. See what his passing's like here. Luis is trying to work his guard up a little bit higher, control that collar. Could see him. He's controlling that, that hand too, so you could see him try to turn for this arm bar here. Eric Garcia showing his brute strength. Picking up the young 22-year-old. Well, he's doing a good job of climbing the tree. Great base there by Eric, taking his time. And we're back up standing once again. Eric right back to his grip, finds it right away. Thumb inside. He's controlling the outer sleeve, so he, he's going to go for this baseball bat choke again here. Turn again for that baseball bat choke. And he's going to pick and see if Eric uses it to turn back. Luis's coach Phil Platt hollering out, get rid of that baseball bat grip. Eric puts it right back in there. Three minutes left in this matchup here. Eric Garcia, Luis Mancia. You have Phil Platt cornering for Mancia and uh, Travis Took cornering for uh, Eric. The wise wizard Travis Took. 
one of the one of the top jujitsu coaches in the state of Texas and in the nation. Still competes at a high level, and everybody on his team. He has an amazing team of black belts here in Houston, Texas. Also, UFC fighters too. As well. Yes, sir. His cousin Andrew Craig. Single leg there from Eric Garcia. Nice takedown. Eric's got two and a half minutes to work here. No draws, let's go! Two minutes, Eric, two minutes! You gotta work! Coming up on two minutes, two minutes. Got you on mute. Thanks, <laughs> thanks, man. Oh, Garcia's pushing for it again there. He's gonna keep turning through. That is deep, that is deep. He and got it. Tap, tap, gets that finish. Yes. No draws. Ladies and gentlemen, your winner of this match with a paper cutter, Eric Garcia!